Tonight, hundreds, maybe thousands, protesting in Miami against the governor of Puerto Rico. Yet Ricardo Rosselló remains defiant amid seemingly endless calls to leave office because of alleged government corruption and a string of lewd and vulgar messages. CBS 4's Hank Tester is live in Wynwood tonight with more on the protesters' demands. Hank. Well, Jim, you're seeing the remnants of probably what was 500 to 750 or so folks out here today protesting the uh, governor of Puerto Rico. They want him to resign, and they were really intense as far as uh, pressing the issue from Miami in support of their relatives and friends on the island. Let's take a look. Northwest 2nd Avenue, Miami, local Puerto Ricans stage a spirited protest into the street in support of friends, relatives on the island. A coordinated message, they want the governor of Puerto Rico to resign. This is about unifying everybody to take somebody that should not be in the governor of Puerto Rico. Puerto Ricans are angry over allegations of corruption as well as leaked chat messages between Governor Ricardo Rosseo and members of his inner circle that include profane, homophobic, and sexist comments about political opponents. Where's the money? Corruption runs deep on the island, but it seems that this time, after a lengthy recession and a devastating hurricane, Puerto Ricans have had it. This is that we have a tyrant for governor, and we had enough. A massive turnout in San Juan demanding the governor leave office. The streets were packed with protesters, even though on Sunday night, Roseo tried to calm the tension, announcing on social media he would not seek re-election, but he stopped short of resigning. Not good enough for Puerto Ricans on the island, nor here in Miami. Uh, he made an uh, uh, announcement that he don't want to quit, and it's super bad because obviously that's like gasoline for our country. Uh, our people is super frustrated and, and disappointed. And a deeper frustration, since 1898, Puerto Rico has been a U.S. possession. These people cite the history. Former territories, Alaska and Hawaii are now states. Puerto Rico is neither a state nor an independent nation. And we're still not a state, you know, we're, we're sort of we're second class citizens. And the folks behind me still hard at it. Uh, they are protesting with all their might. They want that governor out, and they promise more of these protests later on this week. I'm Hank Chester, CBS 4 News. Tonight, back to you.